All right, guys. I am here. Oops. Let's try not to hit our thing. <clears throat> so I've realized in order to get to Rowendell, I have to finish a new voyage. And it's one of the quests I've been kind of putting off. Uh, I don't know why. Um, because it, it takes sailing into um, Wisdom Isle. But I have like three quests that I need to go turn in down there. Um, wasn't going to stream tonight, but just kind of felt like it. I, I still can't get any higher on my KS levels. And I'm starting to notice... No, I don't like that one. I like this one. I think this one's actually the last one, right? 21, 9.9, .9, this one, once I get it upgraded, I think is going to be a really fast ship. But, uh, all right, let's set sail. We are going to go to Wisdom Isle. And I think Wisdom Isle is right here, right? Four of us. Hang on. Chip dirt. Okay, we don't want that one. Lost City. Oh, right here. Durr. Okay. There we go. Let's go to Waste a Mile. And we've got a new voyage. So this one, if I hit F5, it, it tells me I have to finish a new voyage in the Wall of Procyon. I don't know if I've finished the Wall of Procyon or if I'm still waiting on it. But, um, oops. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Need that. That's my guild quest for this week. Ooh, I still have a feast on. That's kind of nice that it stays on even when you're not here. Gosh, I hope this is... Okay, it is showing just right. That's good. Oops. Oh, you know what? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Lots of... Um... um I, uh... I finally did not the art pass. That one though, I guess you can get special rewards as well. I don't know if I want to buy that yet or not. Um but I uh, Oh gosh, where is it? I'll see if I can find it in here. Waste a mile. I think I've gotten all the, the cocoa seeds here. Let's see. Four or four. Yep, got them all. So we have quite a few quests here. Um, okay. Oh, yeah. A new voyage. Talk to Minerva. So I think maybe it was here. Yep. I finally did the express character event. And a lot of these are missions where um, you have to do, like, the clear chaos dungeon Vern. I don't know if I'm in Vern yet. Um, some of these are probably reach item level 250. So these might be the low level and then as I get higher, it's going to progress. But either way, I don't want, I have FOMO, I guess. Um, and I don't want to be left behind. So even though I wasn't going to stream tonight, here I am. We're going to do some questing. It's going to be fun. Oops. Let's talk to this gal, and maybe we'll actually find, figure out what all the books are for. Are you looking for a specific book? Oh, an invisible barrier? A wall in the middle of the sea? Huh, you're always looking for stories lying all, uh, lying all but forgotten in the deepest part of Wisdom Isle. It's been said that, the, that a new sea begins at the edge of the sea we know. The fact that you're looking for the story about this mythical sea perhaps means the myth has some truth to it. This library contains all the knowledge of this world. You should be able to find what you're looking for here. Okay, so since we are here, I know for a fact we have two other two other quests. We, yep, we've got them all. Talk to the book re, book of research. I'm assuming that might be downstairs. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can read all the books here. The book of research. Here we go. These must be the notes written by a shoeshire expert. I can't believe I've gotten to see them. It, and it's all thanks to you. To show you my gratitude, I'll give you a chance to read my pages. But only a few pages. I'm an incredibly deep book, after all. 
So you probably won't understand the content in just one sitting. Okay. So... Uh, visit Lullaby Island? Okay. Hang on. We're going to take off the flotsam because we know we have to gather it and we'll get that. Um, look for the information about the wall of Procyon. It says it's over there. It says right there, dummy. Right there. I've been blinking at you. Okay. Maybe here? No. Oh, right here. Look for a clue about Procyon. The primordial sea was called the Sea of Guinea, but after the chain war, the Sylvans of Roendel cast a massive mana barrier to protect the destabilized sea of the mortal world. I... Dividing Arkesia's central sea into the Sea of Guinea and the Sea of Procyon, with the wall of Procyon acting as their boundary. Omitted. Those who have arrived at the Wall of Procyon, remember, to unveil the barrier and enter the honorable sea beyond it, you must gather the scattered will of the goddess and establish true harmony. Author unknown. unknown. Okay. So we have a quest here. So now we need to go talk to Minerva again. This is probably why we had to do this, because obviously there's a barrier we have to break. Sea of Procyon. So, that's the name of the sea beyond the Sea of Guinea. Gin Gina? Gina? The barrier that you encountered is called the Wall of Procyon. According to the book, the Sylvans built the wall to conceal the sea. I can't understand the rest of the book because of the archaic language. Perhaps some of the Sylvans know more about this wall. I suggest you meet with Fern's most noble Sylvan, Queen Aelin. Okay. Now, I... Uh, let me just make sure we finished everything. See, Fairy Fable, we still have this one. Uh, visit Lullaby. Oh, is that a different one? Okay. Okay, so I think technically we're done here. It's okay. And... We're going to hit a few things. We're going to do a few quests today. We're going to get things done. We're going to shake things up. It's one of those days. Oh, there's my daughter. She's getting in the shower. That'd be a Okay, we're gonna go. Where is this actually? Is that where we need to go? Uh, Lee Tara, it's not that far away. Why don't we go see it? We'll collect lots on the way. I'm a bloody rebel. I think I got the title bloody from my PvP. Ooh, that's all. Okay. I don't know what the bloodstones are for. I don't think I ever earned them. They seem to be really bad at that. Oop! Wait, 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 wait! Wait, wait, wait! Almost wasn't paying attention. <clears throat> I didn't realize it was 30. I don't know why I thought this would be easy. <laughs> but our guild is almost level 2. Which is kind of cool. Hang on. Okay, let's go back to our dotted line. There it goes. 
There's so many islands I still haven't explored. I found actually a really cool island the other day and then I got a special achievement because I took a selfie on it and I didn't even realize that was an achievement. Mercia? So some islands <clears throat> are um, special islands, you know? My ship looked way bigger than his, but, you know, it is a lot older or a lot, you know, it's a level four. Super fancy. Super fancy level four. <clears throat> okay, let's see what we can do here. I was going to choose some gum, but you know what? I'm going to be honest with you guys. I have some loose fillings, and I love chewing gum, but it is getting painful. It is said a fairy lives on this lullaby island, but it might just be a rumor inspired by the island's mysterious and tranquil atmosphere. The old adventurers I met seemed to believe it, though. They told me not to scare the fairy if I ever meet her. They also mentioned that fairies never forget favors from others. In case you come across her, remember this. Fairies like shiny things and hate liars. They're drawn to music, and they won't reveal themselves to strangers until they fall asleep. They might let you hear their voice if you're likable enough. But they're so shy that achieving that will still be a bit difficult. I don't know if they really exist, but who knows? You might be able to become friends with the fairies. Why not? Right? Okay, there are four Makoko seeds. This is quite a large island. Um, I have found a lot of the time on these islands, um, the Makoko seeds are hidden off in different directions. So you will actually, excuse me, you will see like a little, it'll, it won't look like you can get the cocoa seeds there, but um, you'll see like a little area that looks like it has a shallower beach and a lot of the time you're able to actually go ahead and uh, walk across it to hidden Makoko seeds. Okay, so now we need to follow the fairy's voice on the island. La, 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 Is it like a hot or cold kind of thing? Wow, look at these flowers. Aren't they pretty? Oh, I do have... Hang on, let's do selfie mode. I don't want it to be... Low, I don't... Oh, that looks... That looks... I want it to be on her face. Okay. Yep. Quit selfie mode. It's weirdly right in the middle. I'm just not sure how I feel about that. Okay. So we need to follow the fairy voice. I don't know if it's in the very center. Or if we have to kind of wander around and see if we can find it. But we're going to try both. Oh, my cocoa seed. Look. This is my favorite thing to do, is find the cocoa seed. Oh, you know what? It seems to be getting further away, doesn't it?
Does she only sing at certain intervals? Gosh, this is great for resources, though. Wait, hang on. This would be a great place for a Makoko seat, right? Some of these islands are kind of cool. Healthy mode. Sit. What happens if I do that? Well, that's weird. <laughs> no, thank you. All right, so much for that. Sometimes you can get some great shots, though. Okay, perhaps the fairy is up here somewhere. We'll hit these lush trees. Okay. Mm, that's very pretty. I love the waterfalls. Oh, I wish you could see him fully. Do you know, I'll be honest, when I first moved to the Northwest, the thing that made me fall in love with it the most was the waterfall. You've never seen so many, well, I have never seen so many waterfalls. And somebody once told me that this whole area is considered a temperate rainforest, which makes total sense to me because it is constantly rainy here and so it's it's called temperate because it's um a rainforest but not a tropical rainforest <laughs> it's the opposite it's where it's just cold and wet but we have some beautiful scenery one of our favorite things to do uh was when people would visit we would have um trips to go out to the uh, porch and we would see Bridal Veil Falls and we would see, um, we would go ahead and see, uh, oh gosh, Multnomah Falls. And if you've never seen Multnomah Falls, it is just the most, ah, we found her. The fairy holds her breath at the sound of approaching footsteps. Whistle? Barry doesn't seem to want to reveal herself. Wait. Nothing happened. Wait. Oh no! The fairy seems to have lost interest. Okay. Barry holds her breath. Okay. Hello there, fairy. Okay. We did it again! Hang on. Okay, she's still here. Okay, pretend to be asleep. The fairy is getting close. She's staring. Pretend to snore. The fairy has disappeared with her hands over. Oh no! They don't snore. 
Okay. Pretend to be asleep. Open your eyes. No! This is like a choose your own adventure gone bad. Okay, so we have to whistle, I think. Whistle. Okay, there must be something else I could do. What am I doing wrong? Whistle. Wait. Whistle again. The fairy listens for a while, then disappears. Okay. So we completed this step. Okay, hiding fairy. She doesn't seem to be here anymore. Time to check somewhere else. Okay. Whew. We got her though. So now what do we do? Find the hiding fairy. So do we have to find her by her voice again? Ooh, strong iron. A sapling? Wait a minute, wait a minute, guys. Wait, D? Grow my little tree. <laughs> okay, now we can cut it down. Is that awful or what? <clears throat> I wonder if you have a chance of getting a full lush tree out of it. I need planks. I, I don't know if I can make them. But I definitely need planks. Okay. Find this hiding fairy. fairy is surprised to see me again. Put down the shiny pebble. The fairy looks interested. Stand still and wait. She's not answering. Okay. So. Put down the shiny pebble. Remember me? She's not answering. It's a gift. The fairy is wary. Wait quietly. Blushing, the fairy leaves. Okay. I can hear you. Okay. It's okay, Miss Fairy. I can't hear anything. The fairy is gone. Except. Okay. We're getting closer. Now we need to console the hiding fairy. Mushrooms? Heck yeah, mushrooms. Oh no, I only had one harvest on them. <clears throat> that is kind of a bummer. Okay, I like mushrooms. Let's check really quick because I don't think we've been over here for any Makoko seeds. Oh, look at more mushrooms. No matter what, this is a valuable trip. <laughs> the sound it makes is so gross. Ooh, we got the exquisite ones. Okay. I feel like... Perhaps this is silly of me, but... I feel like every single one of these islands have Makoko seeds hidden in the water somewhere. Oh, there's a Makoko seed. I would have never seen that. Where Makokos come from? I got, what is that achievement? Okay, we have picked 300 Makokos. So we'll get a title of Makoko. That's so funny. I, I think that's very fitting. 
Ooh, look at this. Doesn't that look like it's a big raid? What does this say? Secret entrance. That's an hour away? Okay, let's go find this fairy. Fairy girl. Check down here. Shiny things, and they don't like wires, right? I guess I should get these. I need them, actually. And my sapling is still on cooldown. Look at these little... Hang on. Those must be... Oh, look at... I squish them. I squish them, guys. Didn't mean to. I didn't even know I can interact with some of the flowers. Oh, that makes sense. They do move when I walk by. Okay. So she's clearly not here. Oops. And from the cocoa seeds. That person got the special one. It's okay. I'll check up here. Maybe it's up here this time. I'm checking the poopoo. Okay, hang on. I think I saw the fairy. I think she's right there. Right next to this this lush tree. Ooh. I'm working on my art pass, guys. Okay. Did I not see her up here? I thought I saw her. Another lush tree. Maybe I scared her away by hacking things. We're gonna get this last tree too. I have to spend ten thousand energy. Sure, she's not here. I thought I saw her. She could technically be over here. Watch it be in this little alcove over here. Ooh. I really don't know if these give you anything better. Sometimes I feel like I usually get worse stuff from them. Wait, why am I not able to find this fairy the last time? Is she maybe over there? Ooh, forging level up. 
more exquisite mushrooms. I wish I could ride my horse here. I think it's over here. I'm gonna check over there because I have checked um, quite a few spots and I've not found anything. Nope. Nope, just mushrooms. Okay. <gasps> the dragon didn't breed! Oh no! Okay, good to know, Glock. Thank you for letting me know. Because, um... I read recently that they just introduced new species and they were kind of concerned that some of the coding may have been broken. I see that. I will get you refunds for that. Um, but yeah, I will let them know. I'm in part of their, I'm in their discord, which was really nice that they actually invited me to their discord just to hang out there. Like, do you have any feedback on anything? And I was like... I didn't say anything because I would. <laughs> this is a new, a new uh, thing for the dragon. It just eats your points. That's all. It doesn't give you anything. Oh no! Is it totally not working? You can't even feed it. Oh no. Okay. Well, thank you for letting us know. I will let the game creator know. Or not the game creator, but the dragon creator. I can't find this dang fairy. I cut down a tree instead of going to her. And now I can't find her. That was a silly move on my part. There she is. Okay. Woo! We found her. Hiding fairy. Don't come near me. Just watch. I... I get embarrassed when someone stares at me. Listen with your back to her. Mm, you're funny. Could you... Could you help me? Anything you want. Lies. No! Please! Please! Okay. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. That was the wrong answer. Okay. Just watch. Okay, listen with your back to her. I'm listening. Mm. This island used to be quiet, a quiet and cozy place, but then more adventures are coming by the day. I wonder if it's because of me. I need a place to hide. Do you know of a good and quiet place that I can hide? I'll look for one. Really? Will you do that for me? Sure. You're so kind. Thank you for your help. I want to be I, I want it to be a difficult place to find. A place where I can hear the voice of the forest. I can't go out and f I can't go out and about freely. And if you find a place, could you check how it is in the daytime and nighttime, whether it's co or quiet, cozy and beautiful? I know I'm asking a lot. No worries, I'm an adventurer. I see. You adventurers are so wonderful. Then I'll be counting on you. What are you up to tonight, Block? Okay. Now we need to do... Oh, no! So now I would have to do the voices of the forest. So I have to do when Magic Melody is here. Oh! Wait. Mushrooms! I was super excited about that. The Fairy Fable. Talk to the Book of Romance on Wisdom Isle. Ooh. Okay. We're probably not going back to Wisdom Isle for now. So, we are going to get rid of Fairy Fable for now. And we are going to get rid of It's Okay Fairy. Where is it? 
Rohan Bell. I don't know where it is. But we'll do it another time. Wait. Guide. Completed. In progress. Okay, let's close this. Close this. Because I don't have any of those. Shadow Island. Complete and Broken World. Adventurous Guide to Rowendell. Okay. Protectors of Justice. It's okay, he must bury here. Lullaby Island. Runaway Investigator? There's so many different quests that I have now that I'm almost overwhelmed because I'm like, there's so many different areas where I could actually go and start questing that I don't really know where to start. I don't know if anybody else has that problem. <clears throat> But I certainly do. Oh my gosh. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what we have to do now. Okay, so we have to go to Vern. Where is this anyway? Oh, Chucky Island is a special event, I think. Let's see. Okay. We're going to go past Torchok. No kelp heads. There we go. Toto Silver Island. Silver is like a warm and comforting wind blows. Let's just check. Wait, can we get an island soul here? Let's just see. I know we need more island souls. Okay, let's see. Oh, I must have been here before. Oh! Great. Let's see. We've spent a lot of time together now. In all my years, I've never seen a young one like you. You're respectful to your elders, diligent and courteous. In my day, you'd be rewarded for that. And for your reward, I'll tell you a story from long ago. Haha. <laughs> see, we Toto Totoikis originally lived in Tortioc's body. I'm sure you saw, we bustled about and transport the eggs of creation so that they can hatch nice and healthy. That's our job. In my day, I was bustling about and the giant Tortioc was healthy and active. But Tor Tortoik ended up lying down, like now, all because of that lady. Hmm, what was her name again? The lady, her name was... Mm, Nineveh? Hmm, you're right, it was something like that. Tor Tortoik restored whatever it was that she gave him and then he fell into a very deep slumber in all my years we were never as busy as that more life was born from the eggs of creation you see our job was to transport and hatch those eggs the harder we worked the more creatures populated tortoik's body and then disaster happened during his slumber tortoik sneezed <laughs> my friends and i were blown far away by that sneeze onto this island we thought about maybe hitching a ride back home, but we're too old now. We don't have many more years ahead of us, so we figured we'd just retire here. But if there's just one thing we regret, it's that we don't see our babies, our eggs of creation, hatch ever again. Some eggs were blown here with us. In all my years, I wasn't able to hatch those. That's my final wish. How could we make these eggs of creation hatch again? Could you find out, find out what we need to do? We can do that. Okay, we need to examine the eggs of creation. 
Where are they be? Oh, here it is. Oh, this little pine guy. Hmm. Okay. Keep them warm and incubated. Hmm. I suppose the climate on this island is similar to that of Tortoig. Moss grows here similar to what we had on Tortoig's body in my day. I wonder if that will be enough. Okay, so now we have to collect rock moss. <laughs> I am completely sidetracked. This is not what I intended to do. But you know what? I'm okay with that. Because I'm a grown woman and I can do what I want. <laughs> wow. Wow. Maybe not so safe, guy. Yes, yes, I remember. This humidity, this temperature, just like my day on Tortoig. This is the perfect temperature to hatch the eggs of creation. Oh, I got a splendid chest. Thanks to you, we can now keep the eggs warm. I remember back in my day, the unique scent of Tortoig's body. I suppose we can't do anything about that here. Too bad. It's too bad, really. I want to provide the eggs of creation the same experience from home. There's got to be a way. Would you go and ask the sage in Tortoig? I guess we could at some point. We got some kindness for that, which is nice. I'm not going to stop and look for Makoko seats right now. Although, given this map and what I know about it, there has got to be most definitely. Hang on, let's just see if we can find it really quick. We're going to do one quick run around the edge and just see if we can find an area where the water is just a little more shallow. Let's see? If it's a little more shallow, there's these paths that are so easy to miss. Oh, mm, we're not going to be able to get there, but that's okay. It is about time for us to go explore Burn again. Go talk to Ellen. Let's go talk to her. Go talk up here really quick. Just really quick. Really, 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 really quick. So quick you guys won't even notice. I hope. <laughs> okay. We're going back to our ship. And back to Burn! Okay. Oh, look at lots of Okay, eight of thirty. We're doing good. Am I going too high? Nope. It's super chilly. should have hit it first, but that's okay. My cats have decided that they want to sit on my computer. I've been trying not to encourage them to sit on my computer because I uh, fills it with cat hair, but you know, what are you going to do? Wait. First, we're going to collect some flotsam. Flotsam and jetsam. gonna help us get there faster this little island is most likely yep that's tricky island I think we have a quest for that so when it shows tricky island up here there's like a, a few different islands I've noticed will spawn at the same time um, I found an island called Spida Island <laughs> And it's got a giant egg that you've got to crack open. And then once you crack it open, then you, there's like a boss fight. But it takes like 20 minutes to finish. 
So you need a big group of people. Um, you need a big group of people to even, uh, I was trying to hit it beforehand again, but it wasn't going to work. To hit it high and break the egg open before the timer is up. So, wasn't able to do it. Kind of hoping at some point I'm going to be able to get some of this stuff done. I have a feeling though that they may make some changes. Um, I'm kind of hoping one of the changes that they make is that event scale to however many people are there. And that way, even if everybody is over at whatever island, and maybe only you and one other person are on Chucky Island, that you can still get the experience. It's probably hard to do, though, because it's, it's instanced, but not. It's like an open world where anybody can join. Okay, let's repair. And we're going to dock. We're ready. Bots, I think, are getting stuck a lot. We've seen a lot like that. Okay. Let's see Ellen. Okay. I think I've got some of these male sil male bloodstones so male i don't know what i don't know how to say them <clears throat> all right in we go You know what I never really thought about is how they must have built a full castle to be able to get the reflect. Although maybe that's just another pattern. I, I don't know how they did that, but I think it's impressive. You're here. Was the old captain helpful? The wall of Procyon. I see. It is a barrier that we Sylvan is Sylvains created to protect the mortal realm. Not just anyone can overcome it, nor should they. But your destiny lies beyond that protective barrier, yes? It's something that you must overcome in order to protect this world. Very well. I give you the, I will give you a gift. You have one last preparation to make before crossing the Wall of Procyon. What is that? What you've received are important materials used for enhancing ships. Weak ships will not be able to withstand the power of the wall. The Sea of Procyon is unlike the much calmer Sea of Guinea. Guinea? Guinea? It rumbles and roars ceaselessly. You need a stronger ship to explore it. I gave you all the materials I had. The rest is up to you. Come back with a good, sturdy ship that can withstand the most powerful of magic. Your ship is now ready to head into the Sea of Procyon. The Sea of Procyon is a place with fierce waves and torrential rain. The sea will not be kind to you. However, you bear with you the grace of the goddess of harmony, Gina, who has seen your bravery. Do not forget the goddess of harmony, Gina, will permit only the bravest of captains to sail towards and beyond the wall of Procyon. Now it's time to say goodbye. I feel sad to let you go, but I can't hold you back. Now, go and save the world. Okay! So does this mean we did it? Okay, you're here. The Queen of Vern. Vern was built nearly 500 years ago. It reached its current state standing through rapid pro progress. It's amazing to see how far they've come. Okay. I'm excited to see what they accomplish next. We don't have anything here. Don't have anything there. They give her stuff here, but we're not going to. 
Now we're going to leave. I you used to be able to get items for rapport just from uh, gathering. I think they may have gotten rid of those because of the bots. I wish what they had done instead um, is make it roster bound as soon as you pick it up. I could be wrong though. Okay, what is this? Adventure guides, Rowan doll, chip upgrade. Oh, accept. Hazardous breakthrough. The hazardous waters. Okay, let's see. Can you hold out in the hazardous waters? Or eastern hypnos? Okay. Can you hold out in the hazard northern fermata tempest seas? Or eastern hypnosis eyes? Okay. So let's go to the ship upgrade. A Brahms level four or a Tragon level four? Okay, you know what? We just actually need to go to our map and hit ready to sail. I have a Brahms or a Tragon. I don't have either of those. I think these are a little more advanced than what we should be doing. Let's just turn them off for now. Oh, I can't yet. Okay. Is this a Brahms? Brahms? Nope. You were raw. Okay, look at it. That's an ashtray. <laughs> okay, it said to use the white winds. We're gonna use the white winds. Let's take a look at our sails, though. We are unicorn people. We're gonna set sail. I've never actually used my white wind before. Okay. Now we want to Okay, Rowan Dell. How far are we gonna be able to make it? Look at how far we're going, guys. <laughs> we're gonna die. <laughs> I've been through this water before. This water is bad. Use our fast travel as much as we can. All right, we are going to do this in progress. We're going to do. We're not going to track those because we don't really need to see them. More dispatching of the right, right, right. Runaway investigator. Go to Foggy Ridge, Flotsam, Finding the Arts. We know we're at four of seven. Cal Hertz. Cal Hertz. I don't remember. Okay, we're gonna go right through the middle, guys. Right through the middle, right through the middle. We're gonna totally die. Watch, this is how terrifying this stuff is. So much to go through. Look at how big it is. This is no joke. Okay, if we can go fast, let's go fast. Please, please, please. These are like haunted seas. Go up out of the blue. We'll shortly begin north of Barthentine. See? Almost through it. I feel like it, we're still going to be in it for forever. Boop. Come on, white wind. You can make it. You can do it. Okay. We're going to see if our ship dies by the time we get there. Look at how much health we've already lost. Look at how fast it goes down. These deep ups. So, uh, it's an extra 10 every 30 seconds. This happened last time, too. I've been through these waters before, so I'm pretty certain I can survive it, but we'll see. 
Let's see. But look at there's actually some flotsam. Give me some flotsam, please. Now we're extra slow. Fear lingers and reduces sight range. Chip durability. Okay, we're out of it. We're out of it. We're out of it. We survived. Are we closer? Co-op out of the blue has begun. Arthentine. Where's Arthentine? Arthent oh, right here. See? So if you knew the timers, and you can actually look at the timers. If you click on these, it'll show you what's starting when. Oops. Okay, hide that. Get our butt moving. Oh, look, it's rainy. Oh my gosh. Tempest seas? Guys, are we going to survive this? Oh my gosh. To the Sea of Procyon! Achievement completed! Did I do it? Did we survive? Did we die? I don't know what just happened. Okay. 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 How much more do we have to go through? Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Can we stop somewhere? Wait a minute. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. Where am I again? This is where I want to be. Right here. We're going to see if we can repair. I think this is a harbor. Oh, look, we had a quest over there. Foggy Island, dang it. It's okay. At least we know where it is. Okay, I think I can repair here. Which is going to be good. Okay. Z. Come on, Z. Uh, repair. Set sail. All right, Rovendell. We're making it this time. We're gonna make it right across this creepy sea. Oh, that's all I got. Oh, God, I have no. Oh, wow. Wait a minute. Gotta check it out, guys. Gotta check it out. Look at how pretty that is. Shadow Moon Market? Four Makoko seats. Oh my gosh, look at this, it's huge. Did you hear about the nearby market? They have a lot of valuable items. They also have some really enchanting things. I bought too much though, and I can't carry it all. I'll have to abandon some of it here. You can take a look if you're interested. Let's see. What does this do? 
Try the sparkling powder. Sparkling powder? <gasps> My sparkly? Do I get to sparkle? Okay. Read the half a flyer. In order to enter the port. Oh. <laughs> F6. Okay. The shiny paper is half, half torn. Uh, welcome to the mysterious and fantastic night market, Shadow Moon Market. Items come into the market following the flow of magic. We sell different items depending on the time of day, so come visit us often. If you cannot find the items you seek, please return later. We do not accept inquiries about out-of-stock items or restock requests. Anyone can see the fountain at, at the Halo Square. So you have to find the other half. Okay. Wow. This is kind of cool. Look at that. That is gorgeous. There's so much about this game that I love so much. Oh my gosh, guys. Okay, here we go. Selfie mode. I don't have happy? What do I have? Wait. Can I not see them? I don't know why. <gasps> Out of this world! Look at, that's what I did. I took a shadow, or I'm sorry, a selfie at Shinkra. That's where I took the other one. Okay, phantom wing and phantasm and distorted. I mean, how could you not take a selfie here? Um, let's see, maybe if I hit dance, maybe I can catch her in a cute pose. I don't know though. <laughs> there we go. Okay, okay, we're done. We're done. We're done with that silliness. I love the flowers. I love the flowers. Oh, a moon chipmunk? The chipmunk is holding a sparkling piece of paper in its mouth. Is that the flyer? It's hold holding it really tight. Hey, little friend, can I have that? The chipmunk holds up the flyer for you. It then nods before disappearing down the path to the right. Read the other half of the flyer. Okay. Four. Sold in the market. Work by safe magic. Shadow Moon Market respects free trade among merchants. Purchased items cannot be refunded, even if they are different from what you expected. <laughs> Take the ferry nearby. Okay. There is a ferry. <gasps> what? A boot? What's that boot? That's a big... Oh my gosh. <gasps> what? Hang on. We gotta also look for Makoko seeds. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. How precious is this? Hang on. Hang on. Sit. Wait. Come on. Oops. <gasps> I did not know I could BVB anywhere. <laughs> I love it. Okay. Do I need to unlock it again? I do. Okay. So unlock. <gasps> I love this. Oh, I couldn't go to that. Oh. 
Wait a minute though, there's something over here. So before I go there, I wanna check over here. Oh my gosh, I love this. That's the fair, oh, what is that, look. Magical boots. <gasps> Let's move up. <gasps> Secret area. Look. Oh, just so you can go back down. Is there nothing up here? Oh no, we're missing the fairy. Okay, let's see if we can get there in time. <gasps> no! <laughs> All right, may as well go explore. We're gonna hit this boot. Oh, you know what? I bet you it just takes us back up. Seems to be the case. We'll wait for the fairy. How long could it possibly be? What are our poses? Hello, my love. Yes, you may have a hot chocolate. You're welcome, my love. No, thank you, love. Let's see what some of our different emotes do. Respect. Surrender. Okay, we're in the Shadow Moon Market. Oops. Let's get out. <gasps> the chipmunk. The chipmunk nods its head. The chipmunk is gazing at a moonlit spot. There are some vague scribbles there. Okay. A creation fragment. When we gaze at the shadow, it will gaze back. The shadow moon will connect the steps. The traveler will fly up into the bright sky at the end of the road, and the wanderer will find her sunken memories under the sea. You will give sweet fruits to the thankful chipmunk, dance to the shadow moon dance at Halo Fountain, and listen to the stories told in the Kraken Tavern. As you catch colorful elementals and show kindness every day, your hearts will be rewarded when the moon waves five times. The shadow moon will repay your favor. It will never be forgot. Okay. Oh! What was that? That was, was kind of crazy. I hope it didn't steal anything. <gasps> what in the heck? Hang on, guys. Fairies. Look at them. Ah, somebody's swimming around in bubbles. I feel like the characters here look really unique. Hey, we met before in Annika, didn't we? I remember you brought a, a, bought a lucky bag for me. Nice to see you again. It feels like something exciting always happens when I run into you. Do you want to go look around the market with me? A friend I met on this island will give me a tour. She said she'll be waiting for me at the magic store. Okay. Wow. Looks so cute. What is that, I wonder? There you are, cuties. Cuties? You and Kadri. Is this your first time here? I can see it in your eyes. You guys are so cute. It just makes me want to spoil you. How? A tour, of course. I'll show you all the places you'd never see. Every nook and cranny. Shall we start here? Okay, this is Pladius's magic store. Look around and try out items as you like. I do the same whenever I come here. Okay, let's go explore. What are we doing now? Look around the magic store and check the compass on the table. This, I don't know why this reminds me. It's like Harry Potter world. 
Or Christmas. Doesn't it look like Christmas? A surprise magic. <laughs> Necromancer's plank. A plank that's used by a necromancer. Stroke it and something creepy might happen. What? A surprise flower chest, a surprise gift box. A bouquet of flower petals will pop out and make the recipient smile. A plank that is used by a necromancer. Okay, it's another necromancer. A magician's hat. A hat that's often worn by magicians. Flip it over and something might pop out. Helgia's breath. A pouch containing the breath of Helgaia. Open the lid and release a tongue of fire. That's got to be like an item. I don't know. A netherworld harp? A harp that can play the melody of the dead. Play it to experience spring, spring, maybe spine, tingling touch of death. It's only twenty silver. Oh yes. But I wonder if we can buy everything. Buy everything. It's apparently only twenty minutes until everything resets anyway. So let's Wait, buy it all. Necromancer. We're gonna get a necromancer. Oh, wow. What? That's, that's a necromancer. Yeah, it was a plant. Hang on, let's see what they do. Wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh. <gasps> Wait. Is that it? That was weird. Ooh, is that my something creepy? It's a dude. <gasps> um, okay. I don't know what just happened. What did I get? What did I do? Did I do something? What did I do? I don't even know anymore, guys. I don't even know anymore. Ooh, is this an accent? It's my Christmas place. It's like the Nutcracker. It is Christmas here! That's weird, huh? <laughs> is the compass. Okay, it's over here. It says for Claudia's magic store. Okay, look around the magic store more carefully. Oh, hello there. Is this your first time here? Hey, don't touch items like that. They're samples, but don't think you should don't you think you should ask me for permission first? This is silica said it would be okay. What? Silica? Well, I don't know who that is, and I always keep an eye on things and Ladius and Platus is I don't know, magic store. If you look, if you really want to try out a magic item, I'll just give you one. Let me see. Here's a sample of our popular memory lenses. What are memory lenses? What do they do? Ooh, let's use all these. Wait. Okay, there we go. Wow. Okay, F6. Wait, remembering a moment in the past. Let's see what we, what we are remembering. What are we remembering? I don't know. Wow, a pair of memory lenses. That's amazing. Let me try it on. Oh, it reminds me of memories in Arkesia. It shows me the places in Annika and Vern that I visited in the past. Yes, my love. Can I help you? I'm just staring. Oh, you're just staring? Yeah. Oh, ho, a pair of memory lenses. What a neat item. Let me try them on. Hmm, I don't see anything. Wait, there's something. I saw blue and dark for a second. Then it got foggy. 
Now I see nothing. Okay, these glasses are not neat at all. She must not have any memory. Don't you think the future is more important than the past? Shall we go look around the bookstore? I'm sorry that Silica couldn't see anything with the memory lenses. That's very interesting. Dunya, it seems that Silica has no memory of traveling around like you and I do. Ah, it looks like she's in a hurry to go. Shall we head to a bookstore nearby? Okay. But... Sleepless Sammy... I don't know if I should buy it. It's another world harp that can play the melody of the dead. Play it to experience it. Okay, so it's just you just play it. I don't know if I care about being fire. I guess we'll get one just for the heck of it, just for giggles, to say that we did. Um, let's use these. Okay, and then. We're gonna go in. Oh my gosh. Well, apparently that's ghost pepper. <laughs> okay. Now we're moving on to a bookstore. There are little yellow things up here. What are those? Pick up. Oh, they're the boots. Oh, photo shooting. Use skills when they enter the perfect zone. What is this? Photo shooting. Press and hold the camera shutter and let go at the right time to take a photo of an elemental. Okay, let's try. We're gonna try. Did we get it? Oops, that was a fail. What are we taking pictures of? That's a fail. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Drop? Okay, we're gonna put the we're gonna put it down. All right. Oh, I smell something nice coming this way. That's not creepy. Oh my goodness, guys. We are being invaded by ants right now. They're driving me up a wall. They are trying to get everywhere. And it doesn't matter, you know, where we, we put anything. We usually put out some poison for them. But it gets so messy if it spills. I hate it. And then I I don't like poison at all. So I need to find a good way to get rid of them that's healthy. Ugh, my books are a mess. Do you know that woman named Kadri? She's with me. I guess. She just came in rummage, rummaging through the books. It's embarrassing to see her mess up the store like this. I was looking for a book called Swallowed by the Sea. But your friend rearranged all the books. Will you help me find it, Dunya? Please find Swallowed by the Sea. Why not? Ooh. <gasps> Shadow Moon Field Guide. This field guide was written by Shadow Moon Market's beloved adventurer novella. This book is full of information about unusual, bizarre, and unique creatures. You never know what you may learn or what you may learn may save your life one day. Splinter, a giant carnivorous plant living in the deep rainforest of Arkesia. It's said that it, it grows in some places a phaeton. Why did he write about it if he only heard about it? Has he never visited? He has never visited there in person? He said not talking about it was the polite thing to do. It disguises itself as a plant that emits a beautiful light while searching for food. But once it finds unsuspecting prey, it opens its giant bud wide and swallows the prey whole. Because of the sharp teeth inside its bud, the prey dies, leaving only tiny traces of flesh behind, hence its name. 
It's from Leeds, isn't it? The roundy thing. Lucas played with it yesterday. I saw him putting his arm inside. Oh no, he could have lost his arm. <laughs> uh, okay, let's see. Goblin, it is said that the debris produced by the Chaos Gate during the Chain War gained life through Arcasia's power. What an interesting origin. Goblins usually live in groups through most of them, or though most of them, except for those in the Parna Forest, vanished to the south during the war caused by the Sylvans' migration to Vern. They have a unique appearance that distinguishes them from other races, and they have their own economy. Goblins are becoming more prevalent around the world. They are met with many prejudices from those unaccustomed to their existence. If you're going to talk about a unique appearance, at least include an illustration. I wonder if we'll ever see a goblin. Maybe if I go to Vern. We've already met goblins. Okay, so that was not where we needed to be. I'm going to organize these. We're not going to read. First visit the fountain, then take ghost pictures, then visit. Third visit the tavern. Fourth gather mandrakes. Fifth, find the moon chipmunk. As you experience more of the Shadow Moon Market, you will come to love this island from the bottom of your heart. What time is it, my sweet? No. You know. You know. <laughs> Head down, she walks away, but she knows. Okay, the shadow I painted. The shadow I painted is a scorched shadow, and yours is a dim shadow. Did I paint the shadow that follows the traveler when he starts a very long journey? Did you paint the shadow that will long, that will be forgotten when the wanderer chases a long cherished dream? Share a doe. Let's see. From many corners of the world. Let's just see if we can find it. Because. Swallowed by the sea. Find the book swallow. Okay. This is the tragic story of a shipwreck that happened on the sea near the Shadow Moon Market. It was a very foggy day. A ship full of Sylvanes was slowly navigating the sea. Despite the gloomy weather, the passengers were in a good mood, excited for visiting the popular market. The families, friends, and lovers on the ship were talking about the Halo Fountain, one of the most famous tourist spots. Some wanted to make a wish in front of the beautiful fountain, and others planned to cement their love. All of a sudden, there was a loud explosion deafening the passengers. The ship soon began sinking. It is assumed that the explosion took place in one of, one of the cabins and was magical in nature, considering the magnitude of the blast. All the rest, however, remains a mystery. A sole survivor was rescued on the coast near the market, but she passed away before she could say much. There are no other known survivors. The sea swallowed the ship and dragged everyone on it to its depths, their smiles, dreams, and hopes sinking with them. Dark, huh? Oh, you're looking around the bookstore too? I'm putting the books you messed up with back in order. Oh, so Luca said I could look around freely. I guess she was wrong. Thank you, Dunya. What book do you have in hand? Oh, no, Mocha, go away. Jeez Louise, that hurt. She poked me. Um, did you find it while organizing books? Interesting. Very interesting. The book says there was, there was, year was an accident around this island. I will tell Silica about it. Uh-oh. Onlooking Silica. He is a Sylvain. How is the bookstore? Did you find anything good? Hand the book to Silica. Swallowed by the sea. Was this in the bookstore? Let's see. Huh. I can't breathe. Feel sad. What's happening? I'm sorry, but I can't read it. She just remembered she's dead. Take the book from Silica. Mocha, Mocha, you need to go away, little girl. Silica, are you okay? Wait, she can't breathe. I'll take her outside for some fresh air. Okay. There's another vendor over there. Oh, thank you. You found it. What kind of book is this? She had trouble breathing while reading the book, and she started glowing when she touched it. The book was written with magic. She must have responded to it. Do you think there's more to her than meets the eye? 
your, is your friend's name Silica? Use that quill over there and write her name in the book. If she has any connection with Swallowed by the Sea, it will show you something. Okay, so we have to go write her name in the book. What do we do? Watch the shadow from the past. Oh. The shadow wants to leave. Follow it out the bookstore. Silica, take me with you. I want to go to the market. Do I have to follow it or is, like do I go out? Go out. Okay. okay. I want to see the Halo Fountain. When, I want to see the Halo Fountain when we get there. I've heard it's beautiful there. Oops. Terrified. The water is pouring in. Water's coming in. We're sinking. There you are, Silica, you crazy girl. You're dead. I'm sorry. Okay. Just breathe. Inhale, exhale. Okay, I feel much better. I saw a ghost, Silica. A ghost? A sailor's ghost? A ghost that resembles me? No, that can't be true. I've been on this island for a long time. You must be mistaken. I know what I saw, and what I saw were ghosts. Uh, bah. There's all sorts of mysterious things at Shadow Moon Market. You must be confused. Forget about that book and those ghosts. Let's keep looking around. There's a place called Halo Square. It's the most gorgeous place on the island. Okay. She seems to be feeling better, but she still looks a little strange. She looks forlorn. I saw strange ghosts. I also caught a glimpse of them while bringing Silica here. They don't seem to belong here. The title of the book that I showed you is called Swallowed by the Sea, right? Maybe Silica... Let's just follow her for now. Okay, but let's go check out the bookstore first. You knock your stuff off, mister. You too. Darn it, come on. There's a bookstore in here. I gotta go a long way, though. In here? What's in here? What's in here? It's in here. <gasps> what is this? It's like a cool, like, bedroom. Someday when I'm super fancy, I want a big reading room like that. When I was a little girl, my favorite movie, well, one of my favorite movies, was Beauty and the Beast. Where did Ellie go? She was here just... She was here just now. Okay. Missing people courage to be loved. I wonder what you get, because I've got a few of these. Arkesia's Song Collection. Buy it to read what's inside. Let's read it. Okay. Let's just try it. We're going to use all these. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay, a lullaby that my mother sang to me as a child. Sweet dreams, my child, I'm here for you. It was hard today, but tomorrow will be better. Don't be afraid of new things, my child. Mother was scared too. Shall we go to the park for a walk like we used to? I might. It might be awkward, but it's okay. Mother is with you. Sweet dreams, my child. You will become a better psychon tomorrow. I love you, sweet dreams. Psychons believe always that we were not created to be defeated. Strength gained by giving up warmth. The evolution of steel will continue. <laughs> well, that got dark. 
Sweet dreams, my child. Let's cut off your leg. You know, sometimes when my child is like, I've injured myself and I am gravely injured. I'm never going to survive. I'm like, okay, do we need to amputate? But I, I never mean it. <laughs> That noise when you come out is so crazy. That must be the workshop shop. It's workshop shop. Ooh. Oh, look at me. Yay. Wow. What is that? It's a snitch. Okay, let's go over here. What a dazzling place. I feel like I'm in the sea. It's a beautiful square, isn't it? There's a lovely fountain here too. If you make a wish with your loved one in front of the fountain, you'll live a happy life together. I heard that story, so I promise to come here together. I think I was supposed to come to this square with someone. Right. I came to see the fountain with my sweet Romy. Romy? Where is Romy? She's my whole heart. Did you see that? Silica just vanished. Like a ghost. Go find her. Okay. Let's find her before she wanders too far away. She is a ghost. Oh my gosh, guys. I freaking love them. I don't even know what they are. This one looks like he's got a chain. Is that just his goggle? <laughs> well, propose to Rami with this ring in front of that gorgeous fountain. Wow. There's the fountain. Let's go, sweetie. That looks like a man, not a woman. I mean, I don't mean to judge. I really don't care, but it's just kind of weird. Sometimes the gender swapping on this is kind of strange. A ring washed ashore by the waves. Wow. Okay, hang on. You take pictures in front of this? Hang on. Let's see if we can get a good a good prey. Okay, how about a cheer? Hang on, let's see. Dun 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 dun. Get a big one. We're gonna call it quits there. Wow, I love it though. Good golly. That is gorgeous, isn't it? You found a ring while following the shadow. Hmm, it's very rusty. It must have been floating in the sea for a while before floating into the fountain. Silica might recognize it. I've checked the square already. Let's keep looking for her. Okay, we can go up there if we wanted. I guess that's where we want to go. Let's climb this chain. You know, we wouldn't want stairs or anything. We're gonna make our patrons climb chains. This is how we know that you're really interested in our goods. Silica, I don't know any Sylvain by that name, but something full of light just passed by, heading towards the alchemy workshop. I think it's going to give you a full tour. She did say she was going to give me a full tour. That's kind of a cool thing, huh? Okay. Hmm. 
Oh, you found me. This ring. When you showed me that ring, it brought all my memories back. The ring was for my sweetheart, Romy. We were going to explore the market together and I was going to propose by the fountain. But I couldn't. Something happened. What happened? Our memories and dreams all sunk to the bottom of the sea. But I was left behind. I can't leave the island. If I go, who's going to remember Romy? This is the only place that holds memories of our love. I can't leave. Oh dear. Poor Silica. I met spirits like her before. Wandering helplessly around us, they all had dreams and memories they cherish. I want to comfort Silica, but let's find a gift for Silica to help commemorate her memories. It looks like there's a store nearby. We can see what they have. Wait, can I go down this? I cannot. There's my cocoa seeds here, guys. Okay, let's go in here. This seems to be the primary shop. Uh, it's an alchemy workshop. Let's see what we can find here. What is this? A nightfall or a nightcall potion? A perfume of musical inspiration? You'll start humming a beautiful memory upon you. Okay, or a melody. Fluffy cream! That dries your body without a towel. Open the lid and a fresh breeze will dry your entire body. Alcoholic's Mind Stone, a stone imbued with the memories of an alcoholic. <laughs> Touch it and you'll recall drunk memories and feel dizzy. The stupefying mushroom. Okay, hang on. Let's use a fluffy potion and a musical potion. Okay. This is going to be fun. Fluffy potion first. Oh, wait. Did that do anything? Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Um, of these structures. Yellow cheese chest. Butter cookie chest. Hey. Let's see. Radium memory perfume. A squirmy worm chest. A chest filled with disgusting bugs that are occasionally used as materials for crafting. Open it, but be forewarned. The bugs are sticky. Lightning chest. A chest filled with electrifying lightning that is occasionally used as material for something. Okay, or a storm cloud chest. Let's try a bug chest. Okay, <laughs> I don't know what this is going to give us. What did we get? <gasps> no, did I pick a squirmy worm chest? I don't want that. Oh, wait. Radiant exchange. Leave. Oh, wait, she does want a squirmy worm chest? This guest sings with Kadri. Okay, weird. A babbling bug box. It's certainly a memorable and unique gift, but I'm not sure it would help comfort Silica. I'll keep it for myself, but I think we need to find something better for Silica. This looks good. Let's sign it with or sign it with our names. What was her lover's name? Romy, right? Let's add her name too. With a message. Our love's memory will shine forever. Then wrap it up like this. Ta-da! Let's go give it to Silica. Alright, let's go do it. Wait, did we hit all of the vendors? It appears so. Hang on though. Let's check for. an obsession guy. Look at they're doing magic down there. Wow. Do you think maybe my cocoa seeds are sometimes in these spots? Sammy sleep. Oh wait. Wasn't there a guy who couldn't sleep? Okay. We got you. What is this? Radiant memory perfume? 
Oh, look, it's your names. Audrey and Dunya. And there's Romy's name. What a sweet or message. Memories are warm and brilliant, like this gift that you and Kadri gave me. We're sinking into the cold. We, we're sinking into the cold, dark sea, but the warm memories we've made together will shine on. Anytime, anywhere. Thanks to you, I'll remember my sweet Romy. I've been wandering around this place for such a long time, but you two have helped me move past the sorrow. Dunya, Kadri, I wish to cherish the memories we've made together. Let's go take a picture. We helped a ghost, guys. Wait, we have to go all the way to the start? Before we go, let's check this. Look. <gasps> we found a Makoko scene. Yay! At least we can leave knowing we found at least one. Okay, hang on. Let's take a picture of these things. <gasps> what just happened? Up to them. Going somewhere? I'm not sure. I don't think so. We'll get these ones, okay? Oops. <laughs> I don't know what good that does. But apparently, that's what it does. All the way back, all the way back. This is a cool island. Oh, Mr. Hurst, how are you today? Oh, we've already been there. I am exploring, and I'm not doing what I'm supposed to be doing, Mr. Hurst. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just messing around, squirreling. Set the focus with my heart. How I measure all my seasonings, too. What a delightful memory. Thank you for being with me, you two. You made me so happy. Take picture. Here we go. <gasps> I love it. disappeared oh silica is gone doing well thought I'd show some quick love I appreciate you being here are you having a great evening surprised not at all that last moment together felt like a bright warm light being around spirits is always interesting but today it felt I felt something different how interesting did you remember something? I remembered my journey so far. I traveled around Arkesia, trying to escape a reality I could not accept. Sometimes I encountered ghosts, but they were a comfort to me, not a fear. Silica also was a great solace. I hope to see you again, Dunya. <laughs> I'd love to talk with you more. I've spent enough time here, though, so it's time to move on. Thank you for the picture. Okay, I... I'm totally in love with this area. It's like a Harry Potter area almost. I mean, look at the child floating in the bubble. It's so cute. Um, there's a quest in here. This area looks like Christmas to me. Let's see. Okay, Sleepless Sammy. I found your ghost. Oh, what shall I do? How can I get my sleep back? A sleep thief? Someone stole my sleep. When I was nodding off at the magic store, I felt someone's shadow stalking around me. I haven't been able to sleep at all ever since. Isn't it insomnia? It's not insomnia. It's like the ability to sleep left my body. I'm never tired, never have dreams. Something's not right. 
The shadow must have stolen my sleep. Help me. Bring back or bring my sleep back. I've already found his sleep. I don't know if I necessarily want to do this quest as well. We'll do the first part if it goes directly to this the sleep thief. But we can't actually Oh wait, we've got to talk to the store owner. Um, where is he? Over here. Oops, wow. Wasted. Okay, a sleep thief. Oh dear, that won't happen again as long as I'm here. I watch everyone who comes and goes on the first floor. What about the second floor? Second floor? There's nothing but a fireplace there. You can take a look inside if you want. Okay, we've been there before, but let's check and see. Surprise serpent chest. Magician's card, Legorosa's, uh, freezing vapor. Frog transformation rod. Yes. Let's be frogs. I am a frog. Dunya the frog. Hang on, hang on. That's kind of a cute frog. Can I talk to people? I can talk to people. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Can I jump ahead? Oh no, come on. Okay, we, we went through the door. No, we can't jump ahead. Okay, unknown shape. Bark it outside, this place outside. Oh no! <laughs> Poop. Okay, let's hit R. Did I lose my rod? I did. Oh, well. The market outside. Further outside. Ran through the fireplace. The ember burns. <gasps> Where are we? Unknown shape. I got out of the market. I feel better. Oh, Sammy, or rather, I'm the part of Sammy that just wants to sleep. I set out, or I want to get out of here and get some good rest. Sammy never thinks about going out, though. He's obsessed with the Shadow Moon Market. Now he's lost his senses. What if we tried to scare him? Oh, like shock him? I heard that the Alchemy Workshop sells a black box with something shocking in it. Do you think you can bring him back to his senses? Let me see. Based on his memories, the compass for the magic store, the pile of books for the bookstore, and the lamp for the alchemy workshop. If you touch the lamp, you can teleport to the alchemy workshop. A lamp? Wow. Wait. Okay. Not there. Is this a lamp? Yes. At first... Cocoa seeds, the cocoa seeds. We must find the cocoa seeds. Okay, I'm not sure. So that's okay. Let's touch the lamp. That's kind of nice to know that there's shortcuts. That was quick, wasn't it? Fireplace on the second floor to go out. The compass to enter the magic store, the pile of books to enter the bookstore, and the lamp to enter the alchemy workshop. I need Sammy to leave through the fireplace. For that, I need to bring him back to his senses. Help me. Bring me some shocking stuff. Okay, so now we're back in here. Do, 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 do. Let's go find our quest. Okay, shocking lightning. Lightning chest. Okay, Sammy, sleep. That is it. Oops. Maybe he'll stop looking around the market and go outside sometimes. Thank you. I'll go back to Sammy now. Okay, that was done. It just showed us how to move. Is that not cool or what? Where are we? Oh, we're, we're at the start again. So if we come in here, that's a quick way to get around. Okay. Back to what we, we were intending to do. 
All this, this entire time I've been streaming, I've been just trying to get to Broendale. And I've not been able to. It's time for me to finish. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, let's get to Broendale, and then it is bedtime. So, um... See if it can survive this. I'm going to send my friend a quick, uh, a quick little. There we go. <laughs> a little emote. I am addicted to gifts, guys. Oh dear. Here we go. Here we go. This is a long stretch. Just gotta trust that we're getting through it. We're not even halfway there. Sailing speed is 35% less. Oh my gosh. Are we gonna make it? Are we gonna make it? I don't know because we're dying. Let's go straight down. We're going at a diagonal and that's never a good idea. Get through this fast. I think these are really powerful waters. Kind of scared. Earth. Okay. Phew. Jeez Louise. That was rough. What is that? A whirlpool? <gasps> what? Oh, that's a harbor. I'm not seeing any flotsam lately. I've gotten like 10 things of flotsam. Not a lot since then. But I feel like we're almost there, guys. We are almost there. We didn't die. We had to repair our ship, which was the right thing to do. But we didn't die. <laughs> the durability won't last much longer. <laughs> Calm. Calm yourself. I've never gotten this close to wrecking a ship, though. We're trying, man. We're trying. Here we go. Rowan Dell. Pirate coins, upgrade material for one leave. All right, 
Let's repair. Oof, a thousand coins. We're gonna dock. Lake Shiverwave is a port city of the Sylvain built on on the Sheer Cliff. Okay, here we go. We're in Rowan Dow, guys. Oops. Things are loading in a little slow. I've noticed this on my computer. It renders things a little bit chunky. Even in Outriders, things don't load as smoothly as I would like them to. But I'll take it. It means I can still play. It's beautiful, isn't it? A new continent? <laughs> Welcome to Rohendel. Thank you. Oh my. Really? I don't think I've heard that. Okay. Wait. Must have finished the quest. Okay, we finished that one. Complete. <gasps> okay. Complete. Yay! Wait. Are you, do you have good trade skills? No. <clears throat> but we can sell our stuff, and we do have some stuff to sell. Yep, sell that. 14 silver. Full 14 silver, guys. We finally reached Rowan. Triport. Did Makoko seeds make it all? They did. And Makoko seeds here. Yes, these arc. What's an arc? Stop wasting my time. Out of the way. All right. Oh my gosh, I love this area. This is my favorite area so far. I have to wait that arc. Uh, the Sylvains here might know something about it. Will the Sylvains last? Let's go through them. Hold. 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 Must have a permit to enter Rothen. Her Majesty Azina has ruled that all persons arriving in Port Shiverwave are subject to inspection. We thank you for your cooperation. For the ruling, please present your entry pass. How do I apply for an entry pass? If you don't have an entry pass, pass please apply for it with a raw two of the Bamburi and wait until you're cleared for entry. Currently, we're dealing with a very high volume of entry pass requests. If you apply now, you can get your pass in about three years. In any case, you still need a permit. Excuse me. I will vouch for this person. He's not uh, sus at uh, all, Gertia. right? Apologies. Gertia. You've you built up quite burn. the reputation. Follow me. I will be your escort. Thanks. Weird what guy. What brings the great Gurdia to our port? <laughs> Gurdia. Look, it's Gurdia. Wow, guys. Wow, look at the man. The man. Uh, man. This is. I don't know what those are, but they're beautiful. Whatever they are, look at them, and be in awe. Look at that. It's got like a skull on it. Okay. She just waved at me, didn't she? Uh. The word is she's busy uh, rebuilding Zanila. This way. <laughs> You've returned to Rohendel, and Visca's successor. If you don't mind, may I ask why? Enough stories. I'm looking for the Ark. The Ark. I haven't heard of the Ark or the Ark mentioned since the tragedy some time ago. But I imagine you wouldn't be searching for the Ark here unless you have a strong indication that it's As nearby. As a fellow Sylvain, I am jealous of you. Everyone from Lutera Knights to Arthentine Engineers can't stop spinning tales of your adventures. But who better to tell the true story than yourself? I do wonder how close the legends come to reality. Could you tell me about one of your adventures? <laughs> the Mo Mokokos? Oh my goodness, I rescued prisoners in Shushire once. 
I know that not all humans are like that, but the cruelty of their race sometimes astonishes me. And doubly so when your jailers lack compassion. I hear many Shushar jailers accept bribes. How despicable is that? In any case, I'm glad you helped solve the problem, Dunya. For those who were freed, what's ahead of them is more important than what they left behind. What a fascinating tale. Do you have any more stories to share? Oh my gosh. Okay, I get to... Um, mm. Tournament. I've heard about Annika. Annika. Okay. The Cheng Hun Tournament? It's world famous. You actually won the tournament? Dunya, you are truly impressive. Your story was so vivid. I feel like that I've experienced it right alongside you, You're Dunya. quite the storyteller. Not to mention a very special person. Mm hmm. Listen, guy, I'm okay being single. You said you don't have an entry pass, correct? Allow me to furnish you with one. Consider it payment for your exceptional stories. The entry pass will help you travel Rowendell freely. Why are you helping me? Because I err on the side of kindness. Rowendell is a peaceful place. It prospers under Elzowin, the divine tree, along with the queens. I only wish for a weary traveler to rest, rest their legs and recover after a long journey, Dunya. If you need more information about what you seek, I suggest you speak with the Bambiri instead of outsiders. They have been in Rowendell as long as we Sylvains have. I sincerely hope you find what you are looking for. May Elzowin forever offer you shade. <clears throat> okay. May Elzowin bless you. Thank you. Bless you, too. I didn't sneeze. Oh, repair gear. Where are my clothes? Maybe they're just not broken? I'm wearing clothes, right? Yeah, I am wearing clothes. Squeak, 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 squeak. Grandma, we have company. <laughs> Okay. And now, decision time. Uh, the Ark? What's an Ark? Well, you're not very helpful. Look at the tree. What? Dude, where's your pants? Just wearing leaves. He's got some weird skin. He's like a fish. You think they're mermaid people? Don't step there. Ark? Who's that? Is that a village or something? You're terrible at fishing. You'll see. Are these fish people? <clears throat> I like her interesting outfit, kind of. The village is bustling right now. Always a Are they barfing? Sign. Oh, they're crying. I'm sorry, I did not mean to indicate that you were barfing. The Ark? Perhaps old Botambo knows. Old Batambo. Let's go visit old Batambo. Wow. Ah, so beautiful. <laughs> Bambiris. Oh. What brings a high-minded Sylvain to this humble village? The Ark? It's been many years since an outsider came asking about the Ark. The Bambiri do have a story. Well, perhaps a legend. I heard it from my grandfather, who heard it from his grandfather. Rowendell is abundant in magic, thanks to the Ark. Say, would you like to touch the sealed magic? Who knows? You might sense the power you're looking for. Perhaps we will touch... Touch it. Can you feel anything? You can call this magic Rohendel's blessing. It may not be the Ark itself, but perhaps Queen Azina knows what it is. She sure is pig-headed, but she's wiser than anyone in Rohendel. Oh. Um, how could you insult her majesty like that? She's kind of cute. Don't get me wrong, Azina is the most graceful Sylvain in this place. Anyway, treasure hunter or not, outsiders can't be here. If you need anything, you should head to the port market. I do have this entry pass. An entry pass signed by the flamekeeper himself. 
I've never seen a signature before. The Flame Keeper gave it to you in person? Wait, I think I've heard rumors about you. You're Dunya, aren't you? You're the outsider who's, who met with Gerda and Gerdia. So Dunya, what exactly brings you to my village? I seek the Ark. The Ark? Well, if it's related to magic, the Bambiri wouldn't know much about it, but my friend Avon might. Of all the Sylvains I've encountered, Avon is the clumsiest I've ever met. However, he is knowledgeable about a great many things. Avon's house is not far from the market. Pay Avon a visit. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. Okay, so these people, these fish-type people are Bambiri. She's quite spirited. <laughs> Kind of interesting, huh? I also must go. I have matters to attend wow, to it's quite near big. the magic seal site. Okay, I have to actually wrap this up for tonight because um, it's late. <laughs> I have to get my child to bed. Uh, because again, it's late, and I'm being a terrible mother right now. So um, I appreciate you all. Uh, I appreciate you all for keeping me company. Thank you, Glock, for trying to uh, interact with the little dragon. And thank you to Mr. Hurst for coming and saying hello. I appreciate it so much. And I hope you all have a great night. And I hope I get to see you guys tomorrow.